Hello, I'm in Kobayashi, and today I am farther away because I wanted it to be very evident that I am wearing a dress. Because today I'm going to be talking about YA and femininity, and also middle grade, because I've been noticing something especially, that there is a lot of stereotypes about women. And most of those stereotypes think, well, we wear dresses and we only care about our appearance and we can't do anything. I am talking about those, but I'm also talking about the, the stereotype that there is women like me, the way that I normally present myself. I normally wear dark clothing, not always the most feminine, and I wear dark makeup, and there's women that wear dresses and smile a lot and only care about their appearance, and then there's women who, you know, don't wear makeup and are perfectly okay with the way they look and are confident and don't like that stereotype and I'm really tired of it being in in YA and in other genres and especially the glorification of unfemininity. When it first came out this spring I read the selection and I read only the first book and the first thing that set America apart was the fact that she was not fancy. She did not like dresses, she did not want to wear a lot of makeup, she didn't want any jewelry and stuff like that. And for me, like there was just alarm bells going off in my head being like, and I don't want to wear makeup and I don't want to be all girly because then guys won't take me seriously. They're just going to think I'm an airhead. And that is what it's kind of glorifying that everyone else is either mean or awful and airy. And yet she is the intelligent, smart, eligible, good one because she doesn't like dresses and she doesn't like things like that. That's not feminism, that's not equal rights. Equal rights is to say that people like me exist and that most people are similar to me as in the fact that they may wear a dress one day, they may wear sweats the next day, or you know, girls play sports but they also wear dresses. Like, that is normal. I don't know anyone purposely be like, no, I'm not going to wear makeup, or that I'm not going to get dressed up for a special event. Well, and it's cool, and like, I've worn a suit to the events. And I'm just very tired of like, there's these women who are frilly, and then there's these women who are strong female characters, and they're not the same. But most people that I've met are not one of those. They are not a cliche. There's days in which, you know, wear sweats and that's normal and yet in fiction not only in YA but also in TV shows and stuff like that people are often portrayed as if they are only ever one way and that's what really bothers me and I hate that people don't want girls to be put into a box of being too girly they make that the role model of girl is to completely divorce itself from the stereotypical girl, which I think is wrong because make something that is a part of many girls and completely ignore it, that's not right. And I would like more diversity as in one side and I want to see girls who are represented as strong female characters who also wear dresses and and that's not shown at all. And I would love to enter a dialogue with other people and what they think about that or any good characters of many dimensional girls. Ah, because I think that's really something that is missing and I would love to see more. Please feel free to enter the, enter the conversation.